How about a big hug where you are, all of you have a wonderful day. Today we will talk about, lipoma in dogs, symptoms, diagnosis, and treatment. When we see that a dog has a lump, it can quickly come to mind that it is a tumor process, something that alarms and worries dog owners a lot. It is true that on many occasions tumors are malignant, but on many other occasions they are also benign, the best example being the canine lipoma. Lipomas in dogs are a tumorous accumulation of fat cells or adipocytes. It is a benign tumor that mainly affects older female dogs of certain breeds, although no dog is free to suffer from it at any time in his life. The diagnosis is made by observing a large number of adipocytes, and it is generally not removed if it is not bothersome to the dog or there are very deep layers in the skin. We are going to learn more about lipoma in dogs, what it is, its symptoms, diagnosis and treatment. 1. What is lipoma in dogs? A lipoma is a benign neoplasm or tumor that consists of the exaggerated accumulation of adipocytes, which are fat cells. It is a tumor with a firm, soft and spongy consistency that can be solitary or multiple tumor nodules appear. Adipocytes are clustered with thin cell borders. When they are processed with methanol they dissolve, being fat. Lipomas in dogs develop in the subcutaneous tissue, especially of the extremities or the abdominal or thoracic cavity. Sometimes there may also be deeper layers, although it is not as frequent. 2. Causes of lipoma in dogs The main cause of lipoma in dogs is genetic, with the following breeds being the most affected. Doberman Cocker Labrador Retriever German Shepherd Pinchers It is more common in older dogs and females seem to be more susceptible. However, they can be detected at any age, race, and gender. Other causes of lipoma in dogs In addition to genetics, it is seen more frequently in overweight or obese dogs, perhaps due to a low-performance metabolism that produces a low capacity for metabolizing fat, which is why it tends to accumulate. They can also be caused by the body's inability to adequately detoxify toxins due to liver, intestinal or kidney impairment. 3. Symptoms of lipoma in dogs a lipoma in dogs varies in size, from less than 1 cm to several centimeters. If they are large, they can compress or annoy the animal, but in most cases it does not limit them at all in their day-to-day -day life. Lipomas can be individual or appear several, and consist of nodules of the following consistencies. Firm. Gentle. Soft. Encapsulated. Circumscribed. With well-defined borders. These tumors are usually located in the subcutaneous tissue of the extremities, neck, abdomen or chest. They tend to have good mobility as they generally do not bind to deep tissues, which is more indicative of being maligo. However, sometimes they can grow in muscle tissue, appearing firmer, harder and less mobile without indicating that they are malignant tumors. The malignant variety of lipoma is liposarcoma, which can spread to other locations in the dog's body, such as the bones, lungs or other organs. It is a tissue with the appearance of a lipoma but infiltrating, which invades muscle tissue. 4. Diagnosis of lipoma in dogs. If you detect a lump, it thinks it is a tumor process and you should go to the vet to diagnose what type of tumor it is and if it is benign or malignant. The differential diagnosis of lipoma in dogs includes other problems in dogs such as liposarcoma, mastocytoma, soft tissue sarcoma, sebaceous cyst, epidermoid cyst, Histiocytoma. The definitive diagnosis of lipoma in dogs is obtained with a sample, visualizing it under a microscope, where a multitude of adipocytes will be seen, clarifying the diagnosis. Adipocytes are seen as cells with vacuolated cytoplasm and a small, pycnotic, flat and rare nucleus. In the case of suspecting that it affects deeper planes, advanced imaging tests will be necessary, which will also help the surgeon to plan the removal. 5. Treatment of Canine Lipoma. The treatment can be surgical removal, but normally it is chosen to leave it and observe its evolution. If it continues to grow to a considerable size, causing discomfort, dermatological lesions or affecting some structures of the dog, it should be removed. You have to keep in mind that leaving a lipoma is not dangerous for your dog. These tumors do not spread or endanger the life of the dog. Develops your dog's hidden intelligence to eliminate bad behavior and create the obedient, well-behaved pet of your dreams. Hit the instant access button below right now and start your journey to a having an amazing obedient, highly intelligent dog today. Do not forget to subscribe to the channel, comment, and share the video, you are very well, thank you.